labial bow made of 0.7 mm stainless steel wire, used for retraction of anterior teeth and retention of teeth, after active orthodontic treatment is completed. Modifications of labial bow Short labial bow The most commonly employed labial bow Retentive arm distal to canine Used for Closure of spaces mesial to canines Minor overjet reduction Component of retention appliance Activation is done by Compressing the U-loop Long labial bow This bow is similar to the short labial bow except for its extension which is from one first premolar to the opposite first premolar Used for Minor anterior space closure Close space distal to canine Minor overjet reduction Guidance of canine during canine retraction using a palate or retractor. Retention appliance. Split labial bow. Split in the middle which results in two separate buckle arms having a U-loop each. Shows increased flexibility compared to a short labial bow. Used for anterior retraction. Closure of midline diastema. Activation is done by compressing the U-loop 1 to 2 mm at a time. Reverse labial bow. Also known as reverse loop labial bow. U loops are fabricated reversely. U loops are placed distal to the canine. Used for anterior retraction. Minor crowding. The modified reverse labial bow can be used for the correction of midline diastema. And, as a retention. High labial bow with apron springs. Consists of a heavy wire labial bow 0.9 mm or 1 mm which extends up to the buccal vestibule. Apron spring made of 0.4 mm wire which is attached to the high labial bow. Highly flexible. It is used in case of large overjet. And, retraction of one or more teeth. Activation is done by bending the apron spring towards the teeth, which can be activated up to 3 mm at a time. Fitted labial bow. Used as a retention appliance after fixed orthodontic treatment. Begs labial bow. Introduced by PR Beg. Also known as Beg's wrap around retain a roar around the globe bow. Used as a retention appliance after fixed orthodontic treatment. Roberts Retractor. Designed by G.H. Roberts. Used for retraction of four incisors in case of severe anterior proclination with more than 4 mm overjet. Excellent retraction bow. Activation done by the bow is adjusted by bending the vertical limb below the coil. Mills Retractor. Also known as extended labial bow. Extensive looping increases flexibility. Indication for reduction of large overjet and alignment of irregular incisors. Activated by compressing the extended loop and bending the bow palatally. There are some more modifications such as, Ricketts labial bow, wrap around soldered to clasp 7x7 seven seven labial bow, wrap around soldered to clasp 6x6 six six labial bow and wrap around with dual loop and crossover labial bow. Assalamu alaikum. Thank you very much. Look me in the face, tell me that you love me, even if